What do coins, cell phones, airplanes, roads, cars, and table salt all have in common? They're all made from minerals. What are minerals? Minerals are naturally occurring inorganic solid elements or compounds with a definite chemical composition and an ordered internal structure. All rocks, soil, dirt, and sand are composed of minerals. Minerals are found on Earth's surface and underground too. Minerals are the building blocks of rocks. For example, this is a chunk of igneous rock called granite. When you look closely, you'll see black grains of the mineral mica. The grains of gray are mineral quartz, while the white grains are feldspar. Most rocks are a mixture of many minerals. To be considered a mineral, a substance must have a fixed chemical formula and be made from a combination of specific elements. The mineral quartz is formed from the bonding of the elements silicon and oxygen. It has a fixed chemical formula of one atom of silicon and two atoms of oxygen. We know the mineral halite as table salt. Halite is composed of the elements sodium Na and chloride Cl. Minerals form in many natural ways. Some minerals form when salt water on Earth's surface evaporates. Some minerals form as water seeps through crevices and rocks underground. Other minerals form from the cooling and hardening of hot molten rock. Minerals can be easily identified by their physical properties. Sulfur is yellow and has a distinct odor. Gold is a mineral that is a pure metal element and has a metallic luster. Magnetite is an opaque mineral. Magnetite is the most magnetic mineral found in nature. The physical properties of minerals are determined by the elements that make up the mineral and, more importantly, the mineral's internal molecular structure. The importance of structure is best exemplified by two minerals, graphite and diamond. Both are made from a single element, carbon. We know from using graphite pencils that graphite is dark and very soft. These properties are a result of graphite's carbon molecules sheet-like structure that is not well connected. The carbon molecules of diamond are organized in an interlocking arrangement creating an incredibly strong bond. This structure makes diamond a very hard and often transparent mineral. Minerals come in a variety of forms, textures, shapes, density, hardness and colors that are determined by their chemical composition.